Okay, here's another video on 8-track repair. I'm going to try and show you how to fix an 8-track. Okay. Starting with the problem of, of the tape itself breaking. Um, with this particular type of case, I'm going to have to go in from here and actually break a little knob in there. Each 8-track has a different type of, of case. This one has this one. This one, a similar one. This one actually requires Phillip head screws. Um, where there's other types where it's a screw, but you can't actually open it. You gotta break it. Okay. It's that easy. Sometimes. Okay. I'll show you in here. This one is messy inside. Now you notice that the foams are completely decayed and this part is broken inside. Okay. Alright. Remove the, uh, the junk from the inside. Um, find the other piece of tape. Pull it out to tighten it because it's going to be loose. Alright. Now you see this part here? That is a piece of aluminum foil. And that is when, when this comes by, the sensor hits it, that's what tells it to change programs. All you do here, I usually will use a glue stick, but I don't have one right now. I'll use the glue stick to reinforce that aluminum foil. But here I'm just going to take a little bit of scotch tape. And I'm going to attach it to the back of here. Okay. And I'm going to take this part and attach them. Make sure it's not tangled when you do it. Clean up the excess. Okay, very nice. Nice. Okay. Now, to spool it back up, all you have to do, well, in some cases, most cases, is pull from the inner hub. Pull it from the inner spool and it will wrap itself back up. But you don't want you want to be careful because if it's too loose, it'll make it looser. Okay. Now see how that worked? It went right back up. Now, now that that is reinforced, we're going to, well, scratch our name on the inside. this type of case now, it's not going to want to stay shut, so I'm actually going to have to seal it with some tape. Just on the sides. Okay. Then you take 
your balls <laughs> and you put it inside. Just pull the tape up a little. 